Now, we went, we delved a little bit into safety, but I want to show you a little bit more. So we set ourselves up with our proper stance, where we're nice and low, we got our center. And then we find our proper distance. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up to do a basic right cross punch. Now, we have to make sure that we find our illusionary target and our actual target. Now, my illusionary target right now is to hit her right across the jaw, just smack her. But I'm not actually going to do that because that would hurt. So what I'm going to do is my actual target is going to be right over here, about three to six inches away from her face so that it's safe. <laughs> we want to keep it pretty. <laughs> so what we're going to do is I want to give a nice big cue and then I come right across here. You'll notice that I'm nowhere near her face. Nowhere near. All right? So now what we're going to do is if we come back, you can tell what we're doing, right? You can see this is fake. I'm not hitting her. But this is where angles come in. If we position ourselves to be right about here, watch what happens. It looks like I hit her, right? Uh, sorry, you know, I had to. So we want to make sure that we set up our angle and our targeting, and once those pieces come together, you can get a hit that looks really cool. Now, we want to make sure also, when you're targeting, from an audience perspective, if I really aim right here, it might look a little low, especially if we position ourselves where she's over here and I'm coming from behind. You'll notice that if I hit this way, it looks like I kind of hit her in her chest, which is a little awkward. Probably wouldn't cause her much pain, right? But if I put it right above here, right about where her nose is, it looks like I hit her right across the jaw from behind. So it's all about working the angles and doing the trick of stage combat.